the 2014 Kia Optima. The average guy. Sleek, stylish, and packed with value. Yep, it's a Kia. And if you're looking for a mid-size sedan, the Optima needs to be on your test drive list. And you know the drill. Today I'm gonna to be doing a review of the 2014 Kia Optima. The folks at Kia have had a good run. They've been churning out vehicles that are well-built, value-packed, and fun to drive. And the Optima is a prime example of Kia's winning formula. Take a look at the exterior. It's been subtly updated for 2014 with new front and rear end modifications that give it a cleaner and meaner look. The Optima's interior is comfortable and inviting, again with a subtle update for 2014. Most notably, a new steering wheel, which is artfully rendered and comfortable too. Looking around the cabin, the overall build quality and materials are very good, and the design is clean and contemporary. Now while many of the other manufacturers are layering their interiors with shades of black, the Kia lineup has received a lighter touch. An artful contrast of light and dark, mostly matte materials, which is very visually appealing and even calming. There are also nice ergo-inspired design elements, like the slight tilt of the center stack towards the driver, and a new look on cup holder design. Now I'm an average guy, so I'm testing the base LX model that comes with cloth seating. I like the color and choice of fabric used on the seats, as well as their sleek form factor. And the front seats are comfortable and roomy with great lumbar support. Hop in the back and you'll be equally as comfy if you're an average guy like me. But taller passengers may feel a bit of a squeeze back there due to the vehicle's sloped roof line. Again, I'm testing the base LX model that starts out at about $23,000 USD. And it's pretty packed in terms of technology and convenience features. Alloy wheels, tilt and telescoping steering wheel, Bluetooth connectivity, and satellite radio are all standard features on the base LX right out of the box. Okay, so now I'm going to talk about what ultimately is most important, the driving experience. This base LX that I'm testing is powered by a 2.4 liter four-cylinder engine that generates 192 horsepower and 181 foot-pounds of torque. Fuel economy estimates for the base four-cylinder engine are 23 city, 34 highway, or 27 combined. The Optimo feels lively, peppy, and quick in and around town, and powerful enough for highway maneuvers. The steering is solid and controlled, the suspension is tight yet forgiving, and the cabin is nice and quiet with limited wind and tire noise. But overall, the Optima continues to be the optimum choice for the average guy. So there you have it, another honest auto review from an average guy. If you're in the market for a midsize sedan that's a head turner, but not a pocket burner, you definitely have to put the new Kia Optima on your test drive list. And I'll see you next time. But in the meantime, keep pushing play.